Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a taste test with Seattle's Best Coffee K-Cup. This is their house blend. It's a medium roast. It says it's got Arabica coffee. I'll be brewing it today with the new Keurig K Supreme Plus Smart Coffee Maker. So here I've cut the K-Cups open. This is one before it's brewed. Coffee smells really good. The K-Cups come in a pretty standard uh, paper filter, nothing in the bottom. And then here's one after it's brewed. Now I did have, first time I've ever had a K-Cup split on the side, but then I brewed another one and it didn't do it, so. And then there's what the coffee grounds look like after they're brewed. So let's put a K-Cup in. This has got brew ID, so it's gonna recognize and give us a recommended setting. So it recognizes Seattle's best, eight ounce, balanced, and warmer. Now, if we look on the box, this box doesn't tell us what to brew it at. I like to brew my coffee K-Cups at around eight ounces. And if we look at the strength, so balanced is the lowest strength and temperature is warmer. So it's two up from the lowest temperature. That's what the recommended settings are. Eight ounces, we're just gonna press the brew button. And earlier I brewed a cup and I put some cream and sugar in it. I'm not a coffee taste expert by no, no, by no means. Uh, coffee is still really, really bitter to me when I taste it. So I have to put a little bit of cream and sugar in to kind of get that bitterness away. And I'll be con comparing it to kind of like my standard is the Dunkin' Donuts original medium roast. I'll be comparing it to this. Okay, so under a minute, we got a cup of coffee and it's pretty hot. It's already at one, 163, 165 usually. So there's our cup of coffee. You know, it smells really good. It smells, I like basic coffee. You know, there's definitely no bells and whistles, extra flavors or anything. So to me, that tastes like a very, like, I don't want to use the word plain, but it just tastes, tastes like just coffee. You know, not a lot of um, extra taste. It's a, it's a really good cup of coffee. And when I add my cream and sugar, it's, I don't know that I've found my newest, my best coffee yet, but it's definitely right up there. Um, this is probably going to go in my top five coffees. Right now, Dunkin' Donuts is what I've been drinking, but this one tastes You know, it's really good. It's got, I'm not sure exactly what, it's just, it's, it just tastes good. I, again, it's kind of like a, just a, it's a medium roast. It's right in the middle. You don't have that dark French roast or you don't have that light breakfast blend taste. It just tastes like a kind of like a standard cup of coffee. And we'll see how this pod did. Yeah, this pod did okay. And this has the five needle technology, multi-brew. I'll put a link to it in the show description notes. Thanks everybody for watching. If you could, please like and subscribe.